he remained suspicious of the motives of those in political power, an instinct that proved well-founded when Supreme Chancellor Palpatine was revealed to be the Sith Lord Darth Sidious. Master Windu led a group of Jedi Masters to arrest the corrupt leader, and had my father not betrayed him, he might have bested the Dark Lord in combat. Luke Skywalker with the fall of the Empire and the rise of the New Republic, an effort to restore the Jedi Order was undertaken by Luke Skywalker, whose research uncovered much of the Order's history along with the lives of notable Jedi Masters such as Mace Windu. Skywalker learned of Windu's reputation as a respected Jedi Master who served in the ranks of the Jedi High Council during the Order's final years. He also learned about Windu's strong commitment to the Order as well as his military service to the Galactic Republic during the Clone Wars. Skywalker regarded Windu with high esteem because of his adherence to Jedi doctrine, referring to him as a true defender of the Jedi Order's principles. In his book, The Secrets of the Jedi, Skywalker acknowledged Windu as a valiant general who fought for the Grand Army of the Republic. He was also aware that Windu was distrustful of politicians and therefore concerned by the Order's entangled relationship with the Galactic Senate. Skywalker believed that Windu's suspicious nature was ultimately vindicated by Darth Sidious' rise to power as Supreme Chancellor Sheev Palpatine. He learned that Windu had led a group of Jedi Masters to arrest Sidious, and that Anakin Skywalker intervened by aiding the Chancellor. Luke regarded Sidious as corrupt and Anakin's interference as an act of betrayal. As such, he believed that Windu could have defeated the Dark Lord of the Sith if his father had not turned against the Jedi.